All right, guys, we're gonna do a race today. Finally have my mic working. Woo! Let's do this. I hope you guys can hear me, and hopefully it's not mus muffled. What to do, professional league, all Japan GT car championship, Red Bull ring. Here we go. So I'm wearing the Bose Quiet Comfort 35 headphones right now. It's really hard to, to hear myself. I don't know how loud I am because it has the noise canceling, but I have the wire attached so that I can so I can comment while I'm racing and playing video games, which is awesome. Pretty soon I'm gonna get the capture card because I am Okay, revving aside. I'm gonna get the capture card soon so that I can get some good quality recording in so that when you guys see it it's not all grainy. And also, even though it's just for fun, I don't like bad quality anything. And holy crap, it is raining at the Red Bull Ring. So this is gonna be a very fun race. All right, again, hopefully you guys can hear me. Hopefully it's not muffled in any way. Let's do this, racing. Ooh. I'll try racing intermediate. It should be a little harder, but it'll keep the race a bit more interesting. All right, Red Bull Ring, this is a great track. Not super technical, just get your breaking points right and you're good, pretty much good to go. Let's do it. This car is going to be a drift monster. I don't know where to brake. I'm going to try the 100 board. Ah, good enough. Oh, it's still drifty, but... Oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. Oversteer, oversteer. Now, since this is a rain race, you just have to be super... Super careful with the throttle, otherwise you spin out. Clearly. Uh, 150 board. Getting on the throttle very gradually. Nice. Uh, breaking way too early there, but. Better safe than sorry. The car just loves to rotate. You guys saw that, right? Oh man, this is low butt. If this was a dry race, I probably would have passed up like three or four cars by now. The nice thing about the NSX is that you can really brake late because it's such a lightweight race car. But at the same time, I'm not sure how well the lightweight characteristics translate over to rain racing. 100 board. Not bad. Okay, gradually getting on the power. Accelerating the straight line is really important. Oh, those cars are so far up ahead. And no. No. You guys saw that? You guys saw that, right? Oh god. This is gonna be tougher than I thought. I might have to do this race a second time because getting my breaking points right is really hard. Oh gosh. I don't want to switch to the racing heavy wet tires because I think it'll just make the race too easy. But at this point, 
Maybe I should. Racing intermediate, for those who don't know, it's pretty much from when you have dry and wet weather. And in this scenario, it's just really wet. So I don't really know what's best and what's not best. Let's see if I can catch up. I'm gonna be very serious now. Maybe I should turn in second gear instead of first gear. I don't know if that's right, but I should just try it. So instead of first gear, stay in second gear and turn. Because sec first gear is pretty short, second gear is also pretty short, so the gear overlap is pretty decent, in my opinion. If I can set the fastest lap of the race, that means I'm on target to reach first place. So let's see if I can do it. A little bit of a drift there, but... Okay, yeah, I'm on target. Let's see. Oh my god. Ow! Thanks a lot, bro. Thanks a lot. I'm gonna retry. I can't do this. Once I mess up, it's just like, uh... Rage quit. Breaking at the 100 board. And actually, it's okay to go wide a little bit here. The track limit actually extends out there, so I'm going to take advantage of that. And breaking up the... I'm going to do 100 board. Okay, maybe in between 150. And a little wide there, so I'll have to break a tiny bit earlier, but, you know, we're going, we're going. Don't spin out, don't spin out. That was a very good first lap so far. Oh, well, I'm not done yet, but... Breaking out that 50 board? Eh, get this job done. I think the key is to be super gentle with the throttle, and then you can really get the most out of this car. board.
because if all the other cars are braking very gently and I'm braking just a tiny bit harder, I'll be able to catch up very quickly. In case you want to see what the car looks like, it's really nice. The reason why the engine isn't revving up properly is because it's slipping, because the tires are slipping. that drift. Okay, another fastest lap. Oh man, I went way too wide there. I don't want to be doing that. I'm losing time. I'm losing precious time there. So let's break a little bit earlier, right here. Oh man. Mistakes like that. Lost eight seconds? God. No! Oh my god. This is ridiculous. Fudge you! I'm doing it. Let's see how this goes. This race shouldn't take a very long time, but it's taken me forever. My hands are all sweaty. Theoretically, in two laps, I should be in first place. Theoretically. I don't know what theory that is, but theoretically. I drove the Supra here in the rain, and it was freaking awesome. This car, not so much because it's very hard to control. I'm not sure why that's relevant, but I decided to just tell you. So I'm not doing as well this lap, but... Let's see if I can pass the GTR up at least. Okay, okay.
and the car just slides too much. Don't have the fastest lap. Oh, that was pretty good, except the power off the turn wasn't very good, but whatever. I'm catching up slowly. Okay, this, that's the best one so far. Okay, okay, I got it. Saved it, saved it. I went wide, but at least I made the most out of that turn. Got the traction down properly. Catching up slowly. Oh, I see them. I see them. There we go. Fastest lap so far. Except that. Except that.
I am so sick of this.